one little maintenance chore that's real easy to overlook is the little bit of maintenance that's required to make your water heater last a lot longer and heat all that hot water that we use a lot more efficiently. All you have to do is drain the water heater every year or so. Now we featured this idea on our show a couple years ago and we were amazed at how many emails and letters we received and kind of made us uh, realize that a lot of homeowners are not aware of the little bit of work that it takes to drain your water heater. Here's what happens. All those gallons of water that runs through your tank, it'll have minerals and a little bit of sediment here and there and, and that will settle down in the bottom of the tank and it just makes it work a lot harder which is the reason it costs you a lot more money to have all of that hot water. But all you have to do in order to drain your water heater is, if it's electric like this one, turn the power off that comes into the water heater. If it's gas, turn your gas off. Then you want to turn the valve here on top, that's your supply line going into it, completely off. Then do like I've done here earlier and hook up a water hose right to the bottom valve. Now you may have one that looks like this or it may be one that looks like an outside faucet, but you hook this up, then you turn this on to start the draining process. Then you have a pressure relief valve right here on top that you want to open up. That prevents any vacuum from um, preventing the water from running out. Then it'll take a little while. This is a 30 gallon water heater. It'll take a little while for all of it to drain out. And once it's completely drained out and the water stops coming out the other end, then turn this back on and it'll really flush out the last little bit of sediment you may have in the bottom. Hey, this is real easy. It doesn't take very long, but it'll make your water heater last a lot longer.